Reporting on August 10, 2023, a significant data breach has occurred, exposing sensitive information about all serving police officers in Northern Ireland. This breach involved the accidental online publication of a spreadsheet in response to a Freedom of Information request. The spreadsheet contained details such as surnames, initials, ranks, locations, and departments of both police service of Northern Ireland officers and civilian staff members. Fortunately, private addresses were not compromised in the breach. The breach occurred when the police force responded to a routine information request seeking the total number of officers and staff at various ranks. Inadvertently, the source data containing the mentioned personal information was embedded in the response. The data was publicly accessible for around two and a half to three hours, starting from approximately 2.30 p.m. The senior information risk owner identified the issue around 4 p.m. and, with the cooperation of the hosting provider, managed to remove the data within an hour. The police force's assistant chief constable, Chris Todd, expressed regret and apologized for the breach. The breach has raised concerns about the potential impact on the security of police officers and staff particularly in the context of the historical terrorist threats faced by members of the police force in Northern Ireland. Although the exposed information was limited to surnames and initials, the breach has been deemed a serious security risk. Various individuals and organizations have called for urgent inquiries and increased safeguards to prevent such breaches in the future. The chair of the Police Federation for Northern Ireland emphasized the need for robust oversight of freedom of information procedures to prevent similar incidents from happening again. Given the history of violence and targeted attacks on police officers during the Troubles, the breach is particularly concerning. The exposed information, even though limited, could potentially be exploited by individuals or groups with malicious intent. The Northern Ireland Secretary and other leaders have expressed deep concern about the breach. The Alliance leader stressed the importance of promptly offering affected individuals proper information, support, guidance, and reassurances regarding their security and that of their families. In response to the breach, the Information Commissioner's Office ICO, is assessing the situation. An investigation into the incident and its implications is likely to follow. Stay connected, stay safe. Do not forget to subscribe.